Welcome to the Squash Co. Okay, yep, there's water in here. Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and in today's video, we are back with Roblox Titanic. But this time, we're taking a trip down memory lane and looking at Roblox Titanic 1.9. So yeah, guys, let's get into the video. Alright, so let's just pop on board. Now, this is the oversized version of Titanic, as you can see. It is not scaled properly, but it does bring back a lot of memories because this was made back when Roblox didn't really know how to handle meshes super well. So it was all built like this. So we're just going to pop inside and we have the aft grand staircase. Now, obviously, this Titanic has more interior than Titanic 2.0, which will be neat to look at as we go through the entire experience. Unfortunately, some of the areas aren't super detailed and they're kind of just bland. We're just walking around here. Let's go down to Scotland Road. Can we go any further down? No, we cannot. Now, I have noticed that the uh, the stairs are kind of flipped here. Um, on 2.0, the stairs end here. They come down here, and then they go down another deck here. So it's kind of flip-flopped. Looks like we have the door open here. Can't leave, though. Um, yeah, that, that might be a problem when we start sinking. Alright, we got a stairwell here. Now, this goes all the way back up to boat deck, so we'll probably take that staircase later in the experience. But it looks like, ah, uh, we can't go into the forward part of the ship. It looks like it's blocked off. And, um, I believe that they were working on it, but they just stopped because of the production of 2.0. Anyway, we have all the boiler rooms. We're missing the engine room, though, on this model, which, uh, it it's unfortunate, but... Whatever, we got all the boiler rooms, so it makes up for it. There's boiler room five. I think these are actually the same boiler room. Oh, no, they're not. That's boiler room five, and that's this, uh, this is boiler room six. Yep, under construction, check back soon. Oh, okay, never mind. We can just walk right through. Uh, looks like there's missing textures, if there were any textures. There's missing there. All right, we are on the forward well deck, and it looks like the sun is going down now. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and head to the side of the bow over here. Now, this, uh, this game actually doesn't have terrain water. It's the old classic, uh, water that is just one single blue color. So, uh, yep. There we go. Something has exploded. Oh, wow. I forgot that we don't have, uh, the realistic flares. Or the rockets, I should say. Alright, let's head up to the boat deck here. Let's pop onto the bridge. The bridge is very open. It's missing a wall here, but uh, that's fine. Again, there's some. Uh, there's actually quite a lot of inaccuracies, but yeah, looks like the iceberg is dead ahead. All right, we're attempting to turn. There's no one on the bridge. Oh boy, here we go. Here is the iceberg. Here we go. Okay. Uh, looks like the sound is slightly off. All right, then. But it is striking the ship. We are striking the iceberg, actually. There we go. We have struck the iceberg, and it is just passing by at this point. Slowly cutting into the ship, letting water in. Now, I am going to go down the spiral staircase to see what the damage is. We already know that water should be gushing in down there. So let's go ahead and head down. No water. That is interesting. Oh, there's the water. It is gushing in. The water is flooding into the ship. All right, we have water on the floor. Um, is there a stairwell? Okay, they don't have a stairwell there. Yeah, look at that. You can see the water is just flooding in now. They haven't smothered the fire. There goes the fire. The fire has been uh, smothered by the water here in this boiler room. And I have received 10 points. Fantastic. It's like a little maze around here. Oh, there we go. There's our escape. Let's go on over here and just pop on out. And we should be good. All right. Excellent. We are out of there. Alive. But the water is pouring in, which is not the greatest thing that could be happening right now. So, yeah. All right. E deck. Now, I remember we can go on to F deck here. Although, it's kind of missing a lot. Actually, more than a lot. It's pretty much missing everything. You got the pool here. 
We got the Turkish baths, and we are gonna head up to the reception room and dining room now. Unlike 2.0, this is uh, this is a lot more detailed. Again, 2.0 is still a work in progress, and I believe 3.0 might be under construction currently. Who knows? Uh, but as you can see, the dining room is pretty ornate, even though a lot of the things are outdated. It just kind of gives me a nostalgic feel being in here. But as you can see, the ship is listing forward. I think about three degrees now. But yeah, it is just really nostalgic to be back in this game. So yeah, that is the dining room. All right, here's that staircase I was talking about. Um, let's see. So this is the kitchen. We're going to go ahead and head up. Now, what's this? Okay. Oh. What the heck is going on over here? Looks like uh, the ceiling's kind of broken. That's a little scary. Oh, there's another stair. Oh, we're heading towards the bow. Okay, we are at the aft grand staircase. Ooh, that dome is not looking too great. Oh, yes. The smoking room. I remember this. Oh, wow. I completely forgot this existed on this ship. This is just so nostalgic. So nostalgic. Well, here's a cafe, and if we head out here, we're on the first class deck. And as you can see, well, we're on A deck, but we're on the first class portion, which is pretty much all of A deck. There is the iceberg just sitting out there. We are still moving away from it, and we are releasing steam from the funnels. And as I say that, it has just stopped. So, the steam has been completely vented from the funnels. The sinking has gotten pretty serious at this point. Even though it might not look super serious, it's it's pretty serious at this point. I think, you know what we should do? We should go down to the mail room. Because this ship has the mail room. Of course, it's not really super furnished, but ooh, what's going on over here? Oh, back at the staircase again. You know what? Let's take the staircase down. It's one of the hidden staircases for chefs and crew, I believe. Now, the reason they have those staircases is they don't want crew being shown in public areas, so they had these little passageways and, and crew stairwells just for them. Now, we are back in the reception room. There's the beautiful grand staircase. And let's go ahead and head down. Actually, no. We are going to go onto that secret staircase that was actually meant for third-class passengers. But, uh, was never really used on Titanic. And it leads down to the mailroom and the squash court. And while we're here... Where do I go to... Okay, yeah. Let's go ahead and go to the squash court. So we head down here. Welcome to the squash court! Oh, okay, yep, there's water in here. Yeah, that's a little serious. Um... Okay. The mailroom. Yep, this is the mailroom. Unfortunately, it is flooding. The lower portion of the mailroom is completely gone now. Um, it's actually spilling up through the cargo hold here, so I am just gonna get out of here, and we are gonna... Oh, okay, we are on E-deck now. We can try to go through this door. I don't know if this door here works, but we're about to find out. Does it work? Yes, it does. Excellent. And here are the elevators on E-deck. Molly Brown's cabin should be one of these doors, probably to the left here. It's either this one or this one. But yeah, back to the E-Deck Grand Staircase and that beautiful view looking up. Now, is there water on F-Deck? No, there is no water on F-Deck yet. Now, I know that there should be a staircase to the right here. Yes, there is. I don't know where that is. I think that's like an unfinished portion of the ship or a non-complete part. There's a little space there. Oh, yeah, there's water there. Right there. You can see it. All right, let's go ahead and get out of here before we become part of the uh, the lost on Titanic. Part of the death toll. Now, the list of the ship is, is getting quite severe now. You can see how far it's gotten. Back at that third class stairwell on the first class section of the ship, you got the water is spilling up the staircases and there's nothing to stop it. All right, let's go ahead and head up to boat deck. Let's see how the lifeboat operation is coming along. We are on A deck. Just got to get to boat deck here. Okay, looks like we need to start setting up some lifeboats here, so might as well do it. 
Mr. Gillette is setting up this lifeboat. Yes, he is. Wow, you can see the list is getting pretty bad. We've lost the F deck portholes in the bow and some of the E deck portholes in the bow. So yeah, let's go ahead and launch that lifeboat. And as you can see, the lifeboat is launching. Unlike the 2.0 version, uh, you don't have to do anything. You just have to press launch and it automatically lowers. So I'm gonna start doing it with the rest of these boats here. There we go, we got some lifeboats going down now. So much easier, but it's not as fun. There we go, launching that one. All right, we got some gunshots being fired below decks. All right, and that should be the last of the boats forward. So let's go ahead and head aft and start lowering some boats there. Uh-oh, propellers are coming out of the water. That's not good. Just gotta wait for these boats to set up here. And there we go. Start launching these ones, and that should be it. There we go. The boats are launching. You can see that the forward boats are pretty much all the way down to the water now, which is good. These aft ones are going to take a little bit to get down since the ship is constantly moving too. Now, I believe that there is a staircase here. Yes, there is. Okay, so that is good. Okay, this is actually pretty historically accurate here. So passengers would actually jump from the promenade into those lifeboats. I've already discussed this in an earlier video I did on 2.0, but yeah, it's pretty interesting that you can see that those those boats are sliding down there. And the nostalgic feel of this, I've said this like a million times now, but, but the nostalgic feel of being on this game and seeing these sights, which I've seen before, is just crazy. And it looks like D-Deck is flooding, so let's get down there. Oh, look at that, the lounge. We're gonna have to check that out soon. But uh, yeah, back into the grand, oh, that door is locked, okay. Back into the grand staircase. So I'm bending those. Yep, there is water down there. Let's go ahead and head down there as quick as we can. D deck. Oh wow, look at the water. There it is. The water is flooding up and we're gonna see the reception room flooding in any moment. We are missing the bow flooding though, but to see the beautifully decorated reception room flood is, I, I feel is more worth it. We're receiving quite a lot of points here. Can I open these doors? No, I can't, unlike 2.0. Huh. Got a nice uh, cabinet here. I never noticed that was there until now. The ship is creaking a lot louder now. You can hear just the, the metal bending and the wood creaking. It's a, it's a very scary sight to see and hear. Since we're going to watch the reception room and dining room flood, that means we're going to have to use the stairway back there for the crew to get up because, well, this area is flooding. And it looks like we've got a, a bacon here. Here, Hello. How's it going, sir? Well, he's gone. He's off to escape. Yeah, and uh, yeah, the reception room is really going under at this point. I think I am going to evacuate the area now. And uh, yeah, the dining room, by the time this area is flooding, I bet the water is already going to be up to the bridge. So let's go quick, get to that stairwell. Should be just around the corner here. It's weird that the ceiling continues. All right, there we go. All right, back out onto the promenade deck, or A deck. Yeah, look at that. We are in trouble. So let's go to the lounge real quick, and then we'll head to the bridge and we'll watch that flood. And here we are in the lounge as the ship slowly sinks under. Near thy god to thee is playing. And, uh, yeah, there is the lounge, everybody. It's getting darker and darker as the power continues to, to get lower and lower, or starts to get weaker and weaker, I should say. And here comes the water. The water is flooding up the grand staircase. The nostalgia is real at this point. And, uh, yep, there it goes. The water is flooding in to the officer's quarters. Now, unfortunately, in this version of Titanic... We don't get the dome breaking, but I am going to head outside real quick. And as you can see, the funnel is spazzing out and collapsing into the into the ocean. So there we go. Here goes the grand staircase. Power is slowly dying on board the ship. Things are getting darker and darker. Here's this guy. He's slowly making his way out as his computer struggles to render and load everything. As you can see, he's lagging pretty bad, but hopefully he survives. Hopefully we... Meet him again on the stern later. But, uh, yeah. Water is flooding up the grand staircase. There we go. The grand staircase is slowly slipping under. Only three funnels remain on board the ship. 
And after that, we'll be pretty much vertical in the air. The stern will be straight up in the air. Let's go ahead and go down to the promenade deck here. And let's go on inside the... Uh, oh, that door is locked, unfortunately. I wonder if there's another way in. Well, unfortunately not. Maybe we can get into that. I wanted to get into the smoking room again just to experience it one last time. Okay, near that God to thee has started again, even though or the band was playing, or yeah, was playing in real life, is slowly slipping under. The only way to that smoking room is going all the way to the stern. Let's go up to the docking bridge real quick. Never done this during a sinking, I don't believe. Look at that. The ship is just going down quick now. The gym, the gymnasium is going under now. And I think it's time to, to head to the stern. Actually, I think I know another way into the ship. And I... Yes! Right here. Oh, no. Oh, well, that's gone. But, yes! This aft grand staircase. I was going to say the second grand staircase. Now, I think this stairwell actually leads to that staircase that we just went down. I don't know why it's closed off, though. But here we are. Once again, back at the lounge. I just want to look out this window real quick because, yeah, look at that. The water is slowly spilling up. The uh, reading and writing room is going under as we speak. And the water has entered the uh, lounge. What a frightening sight. Imagine being here in real life. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. All right, let's go ahead. We're going to go to the smoking room here. But any moment now, the power should be dying because... We are just at such a steep angle, and the water is just flooding into the crew parts of the ship and into the engine room, possibly, at this point now. But yeah, here we are. Sitting in the uh, smoking room of Titanic as it goes down. We're almost at a 30-degree angle now. Now, I don't know, but there are some points... Oh, no, never mind. I was going to take that, try to get through that door that was locked from the outside. But no, there's a door right here that's open. And, as you can see, the ship is just climbing higher and higher into the sky. Near that god to the continues to play, even though the position where the band stood has now, or has long since gone under. Anyways, uh-oh. Okay, I know where the ship splits, so I'm actually not gonna head that way. Any moment now, the ship is going to split in half, and you can already hear it stressing. There we go, the explosion, and it is split. There is the split right there. Just a mess of mangled parts now. There you can see the split right there. And we are now level in the ocean. But there it goes. Oh, there's a person. That is that guy that we saw at the Grand Staircase. Unfortunately, he has not made it. He is going to die. Gotta get up here. Gotta get up here. We gotta get up to the stern. Now with this... Uh, this, this version of Roblox Titanic, you have to actually struggle to stay on. So, we are just gonna hop over the railing here. Uh, uh-oh, that might not be possible. Alright, here we go. We are going down. We are dropping down now. Here we go. I am probably going to die, because I don't have a... Yep, I am dying. I am dying. Oh, wow, there's the bow of the ship. Hello. Oh, I'm gonna die in any second here. And I'm dead. There we go. Alright guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and comment. Now, I'll see you all next time, guys. Goodbye.